everyone, it's Missy from the Jolly Fit Elf. Welcome back to another Plan With Me video. This week I am planning for the week of June 15th. <coughs> Excuse me, I am planning in my Plum Paper Family Planner. This has a cover from Southern Holt on the front. Um, it looks like this on the front and this on the back. And then I'm using a planner band from Rainbows and Pixie Dust. So before I get started though, I got a little haul from Planner Kate. Let me open this. I haven't even opened it yet. Everybody was doing a big sale for the EC launch. And I thought, well, I need to get some stickers, so why not? So let me put this over here. I picked up some weekend banders and some more water stickers because her water stickers are my absolute favorite. So, oh, those are cute. I got the lights and brights, I think. And then I got the lights, the mix, and or the lights, the mix, and the brights. I don't know. One or the three. <laughs> so, that's my little haul from Planner Kate. Okay, so let me open up to June. June 15th. Oh, look, there's nothing on it, but that's a lie. <laughs> so, I haven't written in this my surgery in this planner. I am actually having surgery on Friday. I'm having a partial hysterectomy, and so, yeah. So, per usual, I'm going to go ahead and put down um, washi tape, or i um, been trying to use up these border stickers from Noodlebug. So, I'm going to put those down. I do have two things I need to remember, so let me get those on this planner. I can't believe I didn't get it in here before, but let me put it down now before I forget it. So I have my pre-op Thursday at 10, and then I have to be at the hospital on Friday at 5 a.m. Oh, <laughs> I'm not looking forward to it. Well, I am looking forward to the surgery, actually. It's the rest of it that doesn't appeal to me. So, if you are watching my music-only version, thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you next time. If you are here for the chatter and to hear more about me and my life and how things are going, then let me get the... Um, planner situated and I'll get started before I go because I watched myself back on last week when I was editing um, it looked kind of funny when I was explaining this and there was just music playing but I uh, I regret labeling my family planner and if when I get a new family planner uh, I'm not gonna label it so the first three are me the middle two are my husband and I or like anything to have to deal with home. And the last two is where I track my meals. So I'm gonna actually um, section off Friday, Saturday, and Sunday instead of just Thursday. And then I'll um, catch back up with you when I'm ready to plan. down um, it's completely uneven but that's all right because I can't get it up because I still haven't bought any in and do that's on me <laughs> so let me pull in my functional stickers and I think I want to do green. Libby and Company stickers um, stapled onto a sheet of cardstock from Recollections at Michael's.
we um, we don't really have a whole lot of TV this week. And these will just be taped shows and we'll probably watch them once I'm home and I'm better. Better, 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 better. So I'm trying to come up with a meal plan because my husband cannot cook. He can boil water, but he cannot cook. <laughs> and that's why I do all the cooking and he does everything else. So I'm kind of spoiled that way, but so I'm trying to come up with things that are a little carb that I can just, he can just throw in the oven or heat up on the stove or those kinds of things. And I have a feeling I'm gonna be eating a lot of salad. <laughs> That's all right, salad's good for you. And then I can't have anything to eat or drink. After midnight, so I'm not even going to worry about the rest of the week on that. So it's going to be a busy couple of days this week because, yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to, I was already scheduled to be on vacation, which is the good thing. The bad thing is, I mean, I'm gonna be recovering from surgery instead of sitting on the beach drinking a cocktail. Although that wasn't in our plans anyway. <laughs> that wasn't in the budget anyway. So, but I kinda had to do it because I had to do it when Rob was home too and he, you know, I have some more flexibility in my job than he does. So I had to go ahead and, cause I just went to the doctor Tuesday and it's already scheduled and we're already ready to go. So crazy, Rob gets paid on Monday. No birthdays this week. I am getting my nails done on Monday because they have grown out. And I've got to cut them. Ooh, this is too long for me. Too long for me. So my goal is to get as much filming done as I can ahead of time and hope that I can be ahead. And ready for the week ahead. This week and next week, so. I do still plan on doing a playing with me video but I may have to film it early. Of course, I'm gonna be on vacation and just, you know, really just kind of chillaxing or whatever you wanna call it. So, it may, it may not do me any good to do a plan with me video, but we'll see what happens. So I may be here next week, I may not be here next week. I don't know. I did a total blog redesign. I'm very proud of myself that I was able to do it on my own. So, but the problem was, I'm one of those people that I'm a Taurus. So once I start something, I have to finish it. So I was up until 4 a.m. this morning, finishing, <laughs> finishing my blog design. 
So if you want to check it out, it's linked in the description box below. If you're interested in signing up for a newsletter, um, you can do that over on my blog. I'm going to try to do, be more active there. I just, I hate to write. I mean, I, like, I don't know. I'm not a writer. I'm not a writer. I love talking. If I could just do like a vlog, I would totally do it. But I use these little um, laptop stickers for my blog post. I'm trying to blog more. And if I can get everything filmed, I can get all my blogs scheduled and be good to go. So I'm having a partial hysterectomy. I think I mentioned that. And he's doing it laparoscopically. So that's good. So he's leaving my ovaries. But he's taking my uterus and my cervix. So I'm a lot of people are like, oh, I'm so sorry. I'm like, no, I'm I'm excited. So <laughs> I mean I know it's major surgery and it's gonna, you know, that can be a little daunting, but I am so excited. I have no, I just can't even tell you how excited I am. So I've been one of those people that have struggled with menstrual cycles my entire life. And we're not having any kids. And I was like, oh, it's just taking up space. So you can have it. <laughs> Take it out. It'll be all right. Unfortunately, I don't have a uterus sticker, so let me just use a bow <laughs> on Friday. Baseball. I forgot to look up the schedule for baseball. The Rangers are kicking butt. I don't know what the heck got into them, but they're doing a pretty good job. So yay for them. I haven't had a whole lot of time to watch them. Um, Rob has been able to catch more games than me because I've just had so much to do. So I'm trying to get, and especially now, I feel like I'm trying to play catch up. Um, they have a game every day. I'm trying to play catch up getting ready to, you know, be out of commission for a week or so. So, so yeah, that's what's going on in my life. If you are a crafter and you're interested in my Jolly Mouse Stamp Club, you have until Monday to sign up. You can do month to month or do a subscription. And basically, you're going to get well, the first month is actually $40 worth of product, plus supplies to make four projects for, four, for 55 bucks. It's actually a really good deal. And then you're gonna get exclusive videos and a package from me every month if you do a subscription, or you can even do month to month. And so if you are new to crafting or if you just enjoy card making or scrapbooking or whatever, it may be something that you're interested in. You can find all that, plus all the Etsy stickers that I use linked in the description box below. I don't link to the cardstock stickers, and I say this basically every week, but if you go to a cherry on top, that's where I get mine. Some people have mentioned that you can do scrapbook.com, etc., and I'm sure that is true, but I... Um, I've always shopped, I've, I've shopped with Cherry on Top for years, so I like their fast shipping and never had an issue, so stick with what you know, Joe. Uh, am I going to put down the sidebar? Yeah, why did I pull that sticker out? I put down my weekend. This is my last weekend sticker, that's why I ordered the other ones.
it's gonna be a crazy weekend because my brother and his family are coming down so I can see my niece and then um, my other nieces and nephews because um, I haven't got to see him in a while and my my Lily is my biological niece she is my brother's daughter and my other one the other ones are my brother's uh, children stepchildren but they're all family so um but Lily my niece my biological niece just lost her grandfather so I've been really worried about her she's never lost a grandparent she never lost anybody close to her before let alone a grandparent and she was really close to him so I've been pretty worried about her today's his funeral so hopefully hopefully everything went all right I should have used these um, Instagram stickers I had from Southern Holt because they are colorful but I forgot them I forgot about them Let's see. I had to stop taking my antidepressant. Oh my gosh, it was crazy. I think it was Tuesday night. Yeah, Tuesday night. I didn't sleep at all. I think I slept for 45 minutes couldn't sleep I was my heart was racing like I don't know if it was because I also had a little bit of caffeine that day and it was interacting with the drug but I took myself off of it the good thing is my doctor said I could do that could, number one because I was on a low dosage and number two if I felt like I felt better so I did and um that worked out to be perfect I had just enough water bottles so if I feel myself, I told my husband, I'm like, you know, if you notice me, if things are starting to get bad, you know, let me know if I'm not noticing it myself so we can nip it in the bud. I can't do anything with these nails. And I keep meaning to find my tweezers. And someone suggested a craft knife? Lord, I would probably cut my finger off. Why aren't these coming off? These normally come up no problem. Let me grab another one. Good thing you get a million of them. Felicia stickers are awesome. Felicia is a uh, the mastermind behind Libby and company. Sweet as she can be. And now she has planner stickers for specifically for plum paper. So you know I placed an order. <laughs> I was like, someone tagged me on Instagram was like, uh, have you seen the new stickers? Are you going to order? I was like, Hello, yes, I'm going to order. Thank you for letting me know. Okay, so what else? I don't think I'm going to be able to go shopping this week. We're going to try to do all of our shopping tonight. Tonight, and I'm not weighing. Maybe I will weigh on Sunday, just for the hell of it. Just see if I lose weight because of hospital food. I've only been in one hospital one time where the food was actually really damn decent. And it was actually pretty good. Pretty good. I need to 
You know what, let me use these stickers. So I've got a couple of places I need to go. Thursday? It's gonna be busy. And make sure I shave my legs Thursday. <laughs> it's funny, the stupid little things I think of, right? Right. Let's see. Don't want to use any of these stickers. No, I'm going to do a mermaid week. It's going to happen. Okay. So let me fill in my plans. Oh, I was going to use those doctor stickers. You know what, and I need to... One sticker that I got from Living Committee that I'm really excited about is an open arrow. And I thought, how awesome because normally when I have something going on for an entire week or a few days, I lay down a piece of washi or stickers, that's what that's for, and then I write beside it or on it or on top of it. And I said, that would be pretty damn fantastic. So, I can't fill in this top one until I go, but my goal is to get it, get my back adjusted before I'm down on my luck for two weeks. So, right, I think I'm gonna write in red. Why not? I got red nails, let me write in red. Okay, let me pull that back up and we will do. Oh, that you got I didn't look at my schedule or my calendar. I don't think I have anything other than what I already know. I sure don't. Oh, it's not even pulling my work calendar stuff. No, there they are. I'm doing evaluations every 30 minutes on Tuesday and Monday. Oh, that's a lot of people. And then my own evaluation from my boss is that afternoon. So, and but then I'll be done with evaluations for another year. So there you go. Okay, the Dodgers at 7.05. Dodgers, Dodgers, Dodgers. LA Dodgers, LA Dodgers. They're home for those three games. Oh, they're playing them four games. 9.10? Oh, then they go there. That's weird. And then this night, I will be in bed, hopefully, because I have to be up at 4 o'clock in the morning. Actually, I actually don't have to necessarily get up that early because we live one block away <laughs> from the hospital. So that is a good thing. It's a good, it's a good, it's a good thing. Oh, that's supposed to be 110. 
white socks went dead. Okay, this is pre op. Staples. This is going to be my chiropractor, but I have to call. Oh no, I smeared that sticker. I've never done that before. Oh well. Um, I gotta be. I don't know what. I've got to call and make an appointment for that. Oh. Oh. There it is. I was like, I know. Have an ultra fine flare. What did I do with it? Okay, the NPO. Okay, so I need to call Dr. J. I don't know why I wrote that twice. Anywhere else I need to go this week? Oh, you know what? I gotta order my Stampin' Up! on Tuesday. Meal planning. Oh, what are we gonna eat this week? I mean, thought about this week. I've been trying to focus on the week after. I know we never had Salisbury steak, but we'll probably have that for dinner tonight. fried quinoa. We haven't had that in a while. That's like fried rice, but it, I use quinoa instead. If you live near an Aldi's and you are a low carb person, they have these things called quinoa chips. They only have them for a limited time, but they are fantastic. They are so good. And they're made with quinoa flour and they are so good. What else are we gonna eat this week? I have no idea. No idea. I gotta think about it. And make a grocery list. <laughs> okay, so now I can decorate. And you know what I'm using? I'm using this um, bicycle that I didn't get a chance to use next week. Because the only thing I'm gonna be doing Friday afternoon is sleeping. I have a feeling. 
I'm betting. I'm betting I will be sleeping. Although it's really hard to sleep in the hospital. It's like, you don't go to the hospital and get rest. That's for dag, I'm sure. Oh my gosh, it's gonna fit. Look at that, it fits so nice. The orange slice by the meal planning is, um, that's pretty great, right? <laughs> that's, that's a smart piece to put that, isn't it? This is the last popsicle. Oh, those are big. <laughs> I didn't realize how big those were. Well, I'm only going to leave the word summer and a couple of splashes of water and I so I think I did pretty good. I used up almost all of my stickers, so that's good. So next time I'll move on to a different set of stickers, maybe. I'm going to have to, aren't I? Alright, ladies and gentlemen, if any gentlemen watch this video. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me for another week of planning. Hopefully I will see you on Sunday and if I don't, um, I'll at least try to check in and let you guys know how I'm doing. Make sure you follow me on social media, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and Pinterest. And especially the first two, I'm sure I'll be posting on Facebook to let everybody know that I'm all right. So yeah, don't forget if you want to sign up for the Jolly Mail Stamp Club information or my newsletter, the information and the link to my blog will be in the description box below along with everything but the um, cardstock stickers. Oh, and I almost forgot to tell you guys. Well, some of you know because you follow me, but um, I bought a new planner. <laughs> I got caught up in the EC launch and I, I almost bought an EC. And I just couldn't do it. I mean, the rose gold one is gorgeous, but I don't need $80 planner. So I, um, I'm i getting a little busier with the business side of things, like with my Stampin' Up! business and stuff. So I want a planner specifically for that. So I picked up a horizontal planner. So I'm going to be doing, you're going to see two different Plan With Me videos um, once that arrives. I'm going to do a horizontal layout and then I'm going to continue to use my family planner. And my family planner is really going to be just about um, life as our family. And then my um, horizontal planner is really going to be specifically about stamping up in my blog and my business and stuff like that. So 
Hopefully it'll be here in the next couple of weeks. I think it's supposed to ship by July 1st. So hopefully they'll be a little bit faster than that. But I know that it's a crazy time of year for them. So I'm not gonna, not gonna hold my breath and not be upset if it doesn't make it um, in the next couple of weeks. But it would be nice to have it while I'm on vacation so I could play around with it. So, and I'm excited about the cover because I redid my blog and I did it in purples and aquas because those are my absolute most favorite colors. And I got the Argyle cover with my logo on front and then I did the colors in the purple and the aqua. So I'm excited to see it. I should have paid for a proof and I didn't. That's all right. So yeah, guys, that's it. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thanks to everyone that's reached out and, you know, about the depression and about the hysterectomy. I really appreciate it. And um, I probably overshare here on YouTube, but I'm, you know, I'm just a girl like the rest of you, or unless you're a boy and then you're a boy, but you know, I'm not any different. So I have the same trials and tribulations that I got to work through. So might as well share that. And if it helps someone, it does. So yeah. So thanks so much for watching, guys. I'll see you real soon. Bye now.